Yeah. <clears throat> Welcome to Inspirational Friday. They said it is the end of the week, but it is also the beginning of a new day. And I know that each and every one of us at different times in our lives face different challenges. But the scripture reminds me of this verse, new every day is the mercies of God. And another scripture says, today is the day of salvation. Today is the day of the Lord. Not yesterday, that's history. Not tomorrow, that may never come. But today I will rejoice. Welcome everyone. As you all know, my name is Paul Edwards. I am your registered representative with New York Life. I work with individuals, business owners to plan and save effectively for that period of time in your life when you will choose not to work anymore. And I also help individuals, I yes, I can help you to protect yourself and your loved ones with life insurance. I call it love insurance. And again, on Fridays, I like to speak just a word to inspire someone, to let you know that there is always hope for a better day. When our Lord Jesus Christ was crucified and the fact that the father raised his son from the dead, the fact that the spirit raised his body from the dead tells me that there is no situation in our lives that cannot be resurrected. When Lazarus died and Mary said, if you had been here, <coughs> my brother would not die. He said, remember, I tell you, I am the resurrection and the life. And as he has inspired you and me to be transformed into his image, and now he says, let this mind of Christ dwell in you richly. Therefore, the mind of resurrection, the mind of a new day, the mind which says no matter how good yesterday was or how bad yesterday was, today is a new day. So we ask him to give us the energy. How many times when we are disappointed, many of us don't feel like continuing, hallelujah. But I'm saying to every person this morning, that is hearing my voice. Today is a new day. And the Lord has given you the ability to think. He has given you the ability to act. He has given you the ability to make a decision and to keep moving forward. Before I close, I always want to read a power gem from the book Power Gem by Reginald Crutchley that you can purchase your copy on Amazon. And it says, as ants follow fat, success follows success. Consistency is the key. Don't lose focus. Keep your eyes on the objectives and you will have the results that you desire. This one thing I do, I don't get distracted. I press towards the prize. Keep moving forward. Take the weekend, re-energize your batteries, love your family, love yourself, and love the Lord Jesus Christ. The proof of your love for the Lord Jesus Christ is demonstrated 
in your relationship with those around you. Be blessed. Keep moving forward. I will see you on Monday. God willing, life sparing with insurance Mondays. But you can call me at 321 557 1155. That is 321 557 1155. Have a blessed day.